I, that's been mentioned a few oh, times. Oh, well, well, I guess so. A couple. Uh, this might have been a repeat, but just in case. That's all that matters, really. The baby. <laughs> Simon's dead. But the baby... That's how he will live on. Our baby. But... Doesn't Eve have a baby, too? So where's Eve's baby? Like I said before, it was three. Something like that. I walked in. Saw Simon. He was on the floor of the living room. His throat had been cut. There was a lot of blood. Instead. So that's Eve describing finding his body, but she must have found it before Hannah, because because she stashed it. She stashed it. Hide body. Mm -hmm. oh. Bag. A oh, couple things. Oh. Yeah. I know another way, but come on. The whole thing was wrong. The bags. I I think they were from our kitchen. You could probably check that. We never go into the cellar. It's just a place we put things we don't need. Dad used to grow mushrooms there. The, the bags were taped up. I think it was parcel tape. But I think it was ours. Right, so... <laughs> Come on. Hi. No more the police let me back in the house. They let me take a bag of clothes with me, but... Ooh. So at this point, the house is still under investigation. Now back to Eve. I click it and it doesn't oh, do it right okay. away. Mm -hmm. I parked up on the street. It was busy, so I parked down the end of the road. I walked up to the house. I knocked on the door. No answer. I took my keys out of my bag, unlocked the door. The main lock was unlocked. I could tell because the key wouldn't turn when I tried to turn it to the left. I walked in. Simon's coat wasn't on the peg. I couldn't see his shoes on the shoe rack. Um, I shouted out for him. I walked... So that's, that's um, a story about the finding the body. Mm -hmm. um, although we know that Hannah had already given an account of that. Now, I guess we could really closely compare the two to see if they're exactly the same. Mm. But there was one other thing I wanted to try and that was basement. Really? I thought they mentioned basement before. Do they say cellar or do they say basement? They might have said cellar. They said cellar. Okay. Well, fine. Considering. I got back into the house today. And that was weird. Knowing your people have been there through my things. It's like I've been burgled. And it worse, obviously. I don't know. I haven't lived in the cellar yet. They sent a cleaner in. As good as new, he said. <laughs> but they had to throw some stuff out. Couldn't get the blood out. And I'm still waiting to hear from the coroner so we can get a date set for the funeral. It's going to be a commission. 
Sorry. Okay, and then this one. It happened very quickly. We hardly had to talk to each other. We agreed almost silently. The baby was what mattered. We'd help each other. We cleaned up. We bagged up the broken mirror, her clothes, they're gone. We took him down to the cellar. We knew I, we had an alibi and we wanted the body to be found later. We wanted to have suspicion on us so we could then disprove it rather than have it linger. Better to keep the body in the house than risk being seen with it. The watch, that was my touch to make sure the alibi stuck. Hmm. So... I'm, I'm just uh, thinking back about when... So this clip comes after that little revelation. Mm-hmm. I'd like to speak to the lawyer now. Please. You have no murder weapon. You have nothing. And all these stories we've been telling each other. Just that. Stories. Mm hmm. Okay, so. Just. Actually, it gives me an idea. Let's see what that comes up. <gasps> There's some other things! <laughs> I wonder if this is one that they expect you to do earlier than this. <laughs> it's Rapunzel. The story starts when she's born. We've seen Mother Gothel, the witch, oh, yeah, we have. takes we Rapunzel. And then this one. This is 12.03. Her story is that she'd waited for him to come back. She put on my wig, some of my clothes pretended to be me. They talked. She'd enjoyed being me. He said he wanted to be with me. Then he took out a present. Another mirror. Just like the one he'd given her earlier. <laughs> that unique present. She went crazy, smashed the mirror. They argued, screamed. He hit her. So she grabbed a piece of the mirror and just swung it round. She cut his throat clean open. She'd only meant to scare him off. Ooh. So it was H Hannah? Brit Pretending to be Eve to meet Simon, I think. I guess so. Oh. Never trust a woman named Hannah. <laughs> oh, cut throat. All these other yep, yeah, yep, yeah, that would have been it. Um, I would just look up throat. Throat, yep, yeah, yeah. Ooh, another detail. We were so close together. On his throat. How? Let's see, glass cut. Slice throat. Wait, really? I mean. Yeah, there are only four mentions of throat. Well, okay. Did you look up mirror glass? I don't think so. Okay, so we found all of those. That's good. Hmm. <sighs> Alright, so I think we're starting to piece it together. So, let's see we have no murder weapon. What about mirror weapon? Mirror 
shard. Shard. Yeah, I don't think they use that word. Um, piece. Like pieces of mirror. Yeah, mirror piece. Um, yeah, we added that. Um, wait, hold on. They would have had to have disposed of all that. I don't even think we looked up blood. Ooh. Ooh, the blood's just gone in that one, it looks like. Good, good. Hang on, is this the one? 120203. 120203. Okay. So, yeah, it's. And then this one, 120236. She was sat behind him. She had my wig on. And she'd been there all day. And she had blood on her. And she was in shock. But yeah, this is an interesting one here. Okay. I've given blood before. Do you need to take that few records? Mm -hmm. Nothing like this has ever happened to me before. Blood. It's probably the worst thing that's ever happened to me. for glass. Come on. Please, no. Second. I've had enough coffee for today, thanks. Glass of water. Oh. <laughs> Never mind. <sighs> so I think we have a lot of it pieced together so far, although I could have sworn we had looked for wig before. We did. I just remember we had to delete, or we accidentally deleted a lot of the footage. Yeah, we had. Or the archive thingy. The wig. You mean. The what type of wig? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, also, uh, I apologize for this. One moment. Uh. Turned into that eating thing. Yeah. Alright, never mind about that. I just had to fix the the sunset fade feature. No, anyway. I've never worn a wig. What kind of wig? Right, right. That is a lie. So we know that now. <laughs> the other group saying other that person person doesn't exist. I don't know what the blonde wig is, but it could be anything. Have you looked at the cat flap? You know, that's something I haven't looked up yet. Cat flap. This was <laughs> that night. I went round oh, yeah, and I she was that. waiting for me. She was furious. Oh. Okay. Blonde wig. I was the only one. Cat flap? Cat flap, also. Cat flap. Cat flap. Cat flap. No, they were shut. Most of the windows were really hard to open anyway. It's stifling in the summer. They were painted over by my dad. Could have left the door open accidentally. Oh, there's a cat flap in the back door. Mm -hmm. No, no cat. My parents had a cat before they died called Domino. It was this little black thing with white dots. We never did anything about the cat flap, but if you were thin, you could maybe squeeze through it. Okay. Uh, um, we also had an unlocked door. Like, 
down. No, well, for now let's just watch these. Yeah. Uh, come on. Booze. Oh, yeah. No, it's nothing. I was going through the top cupboard in my kitchen and the chair slipped and I kind of hit the door with my face. <laughs> we hurt like hell. <laughs> okay. And then... Yeah. I had to let myself in. The door locks if it swings too. Okay. Um, I sleep from the right side of the bed as you come in from the door. You can tell because I have two pillows and he just has one. Hmm. Let's see, locked door. Or was it unlocked? Yeah, yeah, we did. Open door. Open door. Ooh. One more. Are you arresting me? No. Fuck off. Open this door. <laughs> well, that's great. Actually, that does remind me. Oh, there's five times. once a day. Not that there's anything much to say. It's more just what the hell? Did she drop her coffee? Yeah, I guess she did. Yes. Wait. I speak for better yeah, she once a day. Okay. Oh, <laughs> the rest of that, I guess. Mm -hmm. No, I'm okay. Oh. Oh. Coffee? Yeah. Oh, chit chat. <gasps> this is new. Hello. How's it going down there? Are you done? Not yet. Okay. Huh. I guess we fix that when we figure everything out. <sighs> Excuse me. Have we though? I don't think so. Well, we figured out it was an accident. <clears throat> Indeed. Black coffee, thanks. No sugar. Sweet enough as it is. Right. So I've heard that one before. Yeah, so that's Hannah. Back eight years back. It was a present to myself. I shouldn't even be drinking coffee with the baby. It's been hard trying to give it up. I think they say you can have one cup. Hmm. I'm curious whether they drink the same kind of coffee. Coffee, I guess. Milk and sugar. They don't. Awesome. <laughs> it's just as easy as that. Uh, is it this one? Yes. Um, I've got to be. No, not that one. Wait. What? They're wearing the same. They're wearing the same thing, but one says coffee, two sugars, one says coffee, black. Black coffee, thanks. No sugar. They're wearing the same thing. Oh wait, no they're not. Coffee, I guess. Milk and sugar. Not quite. Oh man, that's so close though. Yeah, it, yeah. <laughs> okay. I think, I, I think we figured it out. I think so, yeah. I wonder if we can enter a message. Call. 
let's say yes. So you think you understand why your mother did what she did? <gasps> We're the baby! Aww. We're the baby! What do you say? Do we understand? Uh, no? I'm gonna say no. Okay. As understandable, Sarah, you can always come back again. I'll be outside. Log off and meet me over the road. <sighs> wow. But yeah, and the baby was called Sarah. You know, we haven't, uh... Yeah, that's the only mention. You know what? Well, offline. I think that's the end of the game. That is. Well, and just like how it begins, the game ends. Hang on, X on out the cornerstone thing. This one? Mm hmm Yes, good. Oh, you can't do the rubbish bin. Ooh. <gasps> and we get credits. Oh, wow. Hmm. Wow, that is... It's quite a game, and just like how it begins, kind of on your on your own terms, it ends on your own terms. It's a nice touch. Hmm. Wow. Although, if we're the baby. I'm pretty sure we are... Which one are we? I... I think it's... I think we were right to say no because, um... I'm not even 100% sure on whether we are Hannah's or Eve's baby. Yeah, no idea. Yeah. Uh, or at least I don't. Well, maybe we were Eve's baby because, um... Hannah said she was infertile. Well, infertile, supposed to be infertile after the miscarriage. I know, but Eve never had a miscarriage. No, no, she didn't. And then, uh, yeah, like, they both got pregnant from Simon. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but maybe only Eve was able to carry the term. So, wow. Watch other people play this game and see where they got. Yeah. <laughs> this is interesting though. It's it's a neat way to put together a game. Yeah, it's a lot of fun. Mm-hmm. <sighs> wow. And yeah, these must be uh Yeah, this must have been a um a crowdfunded project because that's a lot of lists. that's a lot of names. Sarah, if you're stuck, you could always try admin random or the unlock command. What? Continue. Yeah. Well, um admin random. Yeah, it saves our our user it saves our progress. Ooh. Oh, it just gives us a random clip. Let's see then. Love home? Yeah. Well, they have one for the glaciers, but it's only for work. I can't remember the number. Oh, it's in the kitchen. I saw it plugged into its charging cradle. Now, something about unlock command. I assume that's not it. No. What's in the rubbish bin? Ooh. Oh, that's okay. So you can oh. Just push that. Oh, this is. I hadn't seen this before. 
Uh, one for the mums. Classic two-player strategy. What? The mirror game, I guess? Ugh. Uh, Do you have to click that? Oh, oh, okay. Um, okay, those, yeah, it's a like, tic tac toe thing. Oh. Neat little game. So that's what's in there. Um, oh. Oh, look at this! Something hidden. Oh, this must be all the stuff we found. Cool. Oh wow, we didn't do very good. Not did we? not not so good, no. <laughs> I mean, admin ad, admin admin random. Ooh, yeah, you can get random clips that way. Um, some of the six foot darkish. Well, that's what we found in the past. Yeah, like considering we had to restart and didn't look at half the stuff we did before. Mm -hmm. Admin unlock. Account unlocked. Query maximum now set to 15. <gasps> Dude. So now we can look at multiple ones of Simon. Oh, wow. It's the Rockington Arms. I don't know why I'm so excited. So, yeah. That's, uh, that's, that's a clever way to, yes. uh, open this up. Yes, there's an abstract one. Yeah, and then these are all clips that we've seen. Mm -hmm. But, probably haven't seen some of these. No, he was as shy as me. I asked, well, I asked a friend to ask him out for me. We had our first date at the Odeon in North End. We went to see Risky Business. I had on my one best <coughs> dress. Simon paid. He bought me a whisper. And I was worried about getting chocolate on my teeth. Mm hmm. Uh, let's see if there's any. No? No? I mean, it's still early. What about Simon and Eve? I thought we already looked up that Simon and Eve. Uh, we probably did. Yeah, we did. Poor Simon. Um, oh, yeah, and the... Uh, that chat uh, window didn't... Uh, pop up. Didn't pop up. Okay. That's fine. Still, though, that's... Uh, that is something. Mm hmm Well, um, what do you say? Uh, shall we uh, call it a sesh? Yeah, I think we should call that a session. Yeah. Well, that was her story, ladies and gentlemen. Hope you enjoyed it with us. Yep. Yeah. You um, did. Yeah, and it's still Saturday, so we'll probably just, for now, we'll just do what time is it? Ah! Check your phone. Yeah, it's uh, it's almost five o'clock. Okay, so we're at least gonna take a little break, and then maybe we'll start off. Maybe we'll start another smaller game. Mm-hmm. All right. Well, um, yeah, this has been her story. Adios. Bye, everybody.